Hey everybody and welcome back to the vlog. I just got my shoes on. We are headed out the door. It is Thursday, November the 19th. It's a little bit after one o'clock. We are all finished up with school for the day. We are officially have started Thanksgiving break as of about one today. Everybody's finished with school. We don't, we don't have school tomorrow and we're taking all of next week off for Thanksgiving break because since we start early, we're able to take some of that time off. So I'm very thankful to have next week off. Um, we're headed out right now to grocery pickup. It's Thursday. Y'all know I normally do my grocery pickups on Tuesday, but everything got messed up this week. It has been one crazy week for sure. So all the girls are in the van waiting on me. So yesterday I did not vlog at all. I had a lot going on. Um, so Allie has been having some like heart fluttering, some heart palpitations the last couple weeks. So I took her into the doctor yesterday. They sent her over to the hospital for an EKG. Um, the doctor called me right after he got the EKG and told me that the EKG did pick up some PVCs in her heart and I asked him what that meant and he said it just means like some misfires of the heart pretty much and he wants her to come Monday morning at 9 a.m. to pick up a Holter monitor to wear for 48 hours so starting Monday at 9 a.m. she's going to wear a heart monitor for 48 hours at home um, and I guess we turned that back in and then the cardiologist is supposed to call us today actually it's at that appointment so yeah needless to say I did not pick up my camera yesterday did not care about it um, had a really hard yesterday really hard day yesterday um, I've just been praying I've been praying a lot and asking the Lord just to touch her um, I know that he can and you know as a parent you just naturally worry anyway about your children so I've just been worried about her, but thankfully today the Lord has given me more peace that I need. Um, I, I, the waiting is always, it seems like the waiting is always the hardest part for some reason. It's like, I want to know now, like tell me something now. But we have to wait until Monday to go get that monitor, wear that 48 hours, see the cardiologist before we have any answers. Um, so yeah, just, just pray for Allie and pray for us. I know the Lord's got this in his hands. Um, nothing ever happens to us that does not pass through his hands first so i can rest assured in that and that he works everything to the good of those that love him and we love him so i'm just trusting so we're going to head to grocery pickup i'll show y'all what we got um, next week if you follow me on instagram and facebook you already saw a little something on there um, but if you haven't seen that already i will have a video coming out this week for you to see um, it's a it's a very special announcement so you'll get to see that this coming week all right so we're headed out for grocery pickup now so when i go to grocery pickup i have to take out this big old stroller because um it just won't fit back here with it so i gotta take this thing out so i have to take the stroller out because i don't know if y'all know what the back of envy looks like but there is not much cargo space at all you, normally i put some groceries back here and some on the side because, just because there's not a lot of room there Holly's gonna push it in the garage for me. Thank you, girl. And y'all, that right there, if you can see, is the exact reason bikes get ran over in the driveway. Hey, Holly, can you move that bike down here for me out of the driveway? Thank you. We are back home. I've got all the stuff laid out here on the table. I'm going to show you what I got at this week's grocery pickup. Um, the only thing they didn't have that I really wanted to get today is paper plates. And that's because Josh and I are going on a date night tonight. Um, and the girls are having pizza while we're going. It's always nice to have paper plates. Okay, they just threw something in the house. But okay. Um, it's nice to have paper plates when we're on a date night. That way, when they eat pizza, they just throw their plates away and I'll worry about dishes. So I may still send Josh to the dollar store to get those. I don't know. But I'm going to show you what I got at one Walmart. I got four gallons of milk, strawberry and vanilla yogurt. I got some more of these Activia yogurts, the strawberry and then some peach. Um, some strawberry Uncrustables. And I did get some things for our Thanksgiving meal this coming week in here. I got some more sticks of butter because I'm completely out. I got regular butter, unsalted butter. Um, some cream cheese, some Cheez-Its, a big box of Cheez-Its, two big bags of mild cheddar cheese. Y'all, I thought I only ordered one bag of these, but obviously I somehow hit two. So I've got two big bags of cheese now, but that's okay because we like cheese. Box of the mini cinnamon toast waffles, two boxes of blueberry waffles, 
two boxes of the vanilla almond special K. This was supposed to be special K fruit and yogurt, but they substituted for this fruit and yogurt awake. <laughs> um, some honey O's, frosted mini wheat strawberry. Emily requested I get some of those. Boxes of cherry Nutri-Green bars and then a box of strawberry, a box of apple cinnamon. Log cabin syrup, one of our favorites. Some more peanut butter crackers, and I'm actually about to have a pack of these Ritz Bits crackers. The girls like to have that as a side for lunch sometimes. A bag of Doritos. What do you know? More cheese. String cheese. Another bag of pepperonis. Y'all, I have been hooked on salads here lately with pepperonis, red onions, cheese, croutons, and ranch on it. Oh, and grapes. So, so good. So, I've been hooked on pepperoni salads lately. Um, some more bacon. Two loaves of bread. Some more of my swirl cinnamon raisin bread. I've never bought this before, so this is new. It's stone fire um, bread, and I'm gonna try to make some papadillas with those, um, like with the pepperonis, banana peppers, things like that. So I'm excited some of applesauce. I actually bought the great value um, sweet applesauce, but they substituted for the name brand, no sugar added. I don't think that's gonna go over very well in my house, but okay. Some granola for our yogurt. A bunch of bananas, um, another bag of sugar, 1850k cups. This elbow macaroni is for our homemade mac and cheese. Someone asked me about that and I'll show you how I make my um, homemade Thanksgiving mac and cheese. I only make it at Thanksgiving and Christmas for some reason. Some yeast rolls, some corn dogs. Their girls really requested that I get some corn dogs and Hot Pockets for lunch. They enjoy stuff like that. So I got it this time for them. Some saltine crackers back there. These vanilla wafers are for our banana pudding we always make on Thanksgiving as well as the actual pudding itself. And then canned foods. I got SpaghettiOs. I got cream of celery, cream of chicken, home, uh, home style chicken noodle soup. Just a few canned foods there. But on to household stuff. I got another thing of Tide laundry detergent, two bags of baby wipes, some aluminum foil. Um, Y'all, you see all these diapers in here? It's four bags of diapers. I technically ordered the big box of Love's diapers, but they substituted for four bags, which is fine. That's okay. Um, toilet paper. I really think they could have done better with this substitution. I ordered the Scott bathroom paper. They substituted with like this really cheap 98 cent bathroom tissue. Not that there's anything wrong with it, but I just feel like they should have maybe substituted with something better, but that's okay. Um, some Cascade. I got some freezer bags, the smaller ones, and then I got the large ones as well. Some cups. These are also for our Thanksgiving meal. I'm just going to put these up so they don't get used before then. And some paper towels. It's not as much as I normally get at a Walmart grocery pickup. Um, and that's because yesterday I ran into Ingles. I got several things I needed there. And then let's see. Also went into Bilo a few days ago and picked up just a few things. So through the week, I've got a few things um, here and there. So I didn't need a whole lot at Walmart. I do know I do need to get some like sweet potato stuff for our, our sweet potato pie. So I do need to make like just a Thanksgiving run in itself to make sure we have everything for our dinner, like our paper plates and napkins, all that good stuff. So we've already got our turkeys. They're out in the freezer in the garage. So I've got those at least. I got those on sale, by the way. Very good deal. That's it for our grocery haul, but don't go anywhere because Josh and I have date night tonight. So I'm going to carry you along with us tonight. Uh, we are planning on doing, um, getting something quick to eat and doing Christmas shopping. I always enjoy our once a year getting to go on a date night to do some Christmas shopping together. So that is our plans for tonight to grab something quick to eat, head out and do a little bit of Christmas shopping. So y'all don't go anywhere yet. All right. So we're out now. We're finally out. Um, it took us forever to get here. But we're about to get out and eat at Longhorn. Josh chose where we ate tonight, but Longhorn's my favorite restaurant to go to. So hopefully it don't take long in here because we want to get some Christmas shopping done tonight. I at least want to go and get all of the stocking stuffers. That is like the main thing I want to get tonight is stocking stuffers. So let's go in here and eat. Stop. was Academy. 
we found a few things in there. We got um, something off of Emily's Christmas list that she really wanted. And some of the shirts that Allie wanted were marked down to 4 dollars So we got her a shirt. Josh and I got a pair of Christmas pajama pants. Because you know we got all the girls um, pajamas for Christmas. So we got some of the buffalo check there on sale. What else did we get? Uh, yeah, for Bud. Yeah, for Bud. Christmas, yeah. So I think that was it. And one stocking stuffer. Now we're headed to the Target dollar spot. Um, we're back home about to get changed for bed this is the pajama pants me and Josh got they match he got the um, buffalo check and then I got the buffalo check they were only $9.99 a piece I got the like the fleece feeling kind so I'm about to put these on and get cozy for bed here soon that's gonna be it for today's vlog I thank y'all so much for watching if you're new here please hit that subscribe button down below and I'll talk to you in the comments bye